Hey guys, what's up? It's a girl Shelly here and welcome back to my channel. As you guys can see from the thumbnail and the title of this video, I'm gonna be doing a bathroom remodel. So I know this is it is like right in y'all faces, forgive me. But ever since COVID, everybody's getting into like the home decor, bathroom makeover, this, this, that, and a third with their house. So um, I'm gonna start a renter's friendly series on my channel i've been wanting to do it for a long long time now um so yeah i'm gonna show you guys my crusty rusty bathroom like i'm so embarrassed to show you but here we go ah! all right so look at the lighting you guys like y'all see how yellow that looks super yellow you can see like the stains on the door from the fingerprints so my house is painted in a kind of like a creamish, yellowish, ugly color. And we about to change all of that. Okay, so ready, set. Ah! Ah, there we go, you guys. My bathroom is super small, by the way. Let me move this thing here so that I can show you guys. But this is what my bathroom looks like. I have these ugly rugs on the floor and the bleach actually touched it on the corner. So these rugs I gotta throw out. Um, in here has like this little teeny tiny cabinet. I have a fly catcher right there because there was a fly in here and I could not get him out. And he was actually in the bathroom in this little space. So I bought a bunch of these and put them up in my house and I actually caught the fly probably like a month ago, but yet it's still there. <laughs> As you guys can see, there's a huge wall right here, a really, really big wall. And what I want to do for this wall is take all this stuff down. I'm going to take out this cabinet and I'm just going to put a big mirror right here. I really don't use this cabinet. So I'm going to take it out and save it for when I'm ready to move. And if you guys can see like the color of the wall, that's hideous. Um, I have this little nook right here that's an absolute mess. And there's actually a window right here that we don't use at all because it's in the middle of nowhere. It's in like the corner of a of our building. Also, you can see that there's a bunch of junk right here. I'm gonna get rid of all this stuff. And then what I wanna do for this little nook is like add some shelving. And then this little basket down here that I store my towels. I'm gonna move my towels from down here and I'm actually gonna put my towels up here. I think it'll just be a lot better. It'll be tucked away. Then I have this ugly cabinet in here. I hate this color. I really, really do hate this color. So I think I'm gonna change this to white. So I don't know if you guys can see like the corner of the bathroom. It's really disgusting. So the grout came out and I told my landlord to come over and redo the grouting. And what my landlord did was put, um, I think it's silicone that he put in the corners, in the crevices, and the silicone just, I don't know, I guess it didn't dry properly, or I don't know what the case was, but the silicone came out like the next day, like it just came out. So I called my landlord to come back and re grout the bathroom again, and homeboy came back and put the clear, clear, silicone for the second time so i'm like if the silicone didn't work the first time why would you put the silicone the second time i don't understand but anyways it it dried but it looked like really really nasty so look how disgusting that it oh god that's so disgusting so um back here this white thing that's down here this is a piece of Thing that I found on AliExpress actually that you put in the corners of your bathroom and it makes it look white and pretty and that's what this is so I'm gonna rip this out I'm gonna scrape the grout out of the crevices I'm gonna re-grout the whole tiling of the bathroom I'm gonna figure out how I'm gonna scrub down here I'm also gonna paint the bathroom in white I want the bathroom to be all white I'm gonna change the bulbs to be super bright I have this huge wall right here that I don't know what I want to do yet but I bought like some towel baskets that I'm gonna put here and then I'm gonna change this bar 
two towel hooks and hang my towels on here. So this is another thing that I have behind the door, which is always annoying. So if I don't get any drawer fixture, I'm gonna take it and I'm gonna put it over here on this side and I'm just gonna organize this stuff really nice. So I'm gonna start by taking everything out of this bathroom. I'm gonna start with the painting, the scrubbing of the towels, and yeah, I think that's what we're gonna do. So let's go ahead and get started. All right, you guys, so the first thing I wanna do in my bathroom is change the bulb. already that's what I call the bright light so I'm gonna move on to removing everything out of the bathroom so let's do it I'm so excited already you guys I got this drill from Ikea my mom actually bought this it was only $20 okay it is good get it A whole hole back there, you guys. Well, okay. look at this. Ew, that's disgusting. So the paint that I'm gonna use is this one by Bear. Is their marquee paint, and all you need for this paint is one coat. It says so. I'm hoping that I don't have to use two coats. And this is a one hour dry paint, it says. This is paint and primer. So this is like an ultra bright white. So this is the paint that I'm gonna be using for the bathroom. Also picked up this package from Home Depot and I got two of the large rollers. I got a mini roller and I got the roller brush in here. This was only $25, so hopefully that was a good deal because that's how much I paid for it. Also pick up these two paint brushes. So I'm gonna use one of these paint brushes to go all around the um, crevices and corners of the bathroom and then I'm just gonna roll it out with the brush so let's go ahead and get started I wanted to buy some blue tape you guys to like put around like the border of the tiling but I forgot the blue tape so I'm gonna just have to wing it okay and I'm not a good painter but I'm just gonna have to wing it. Thank you. 
guys so it is Sunday morning I think I started Friday night right I started Friday night and I wanted to show you guys a little bit of updates <laughs> how far I've got I haven't gotten like too too far but I do have some progress that I didn't film so I wanted to show you guys so I currently still have a mess in here the shelves are up and I put the thing that I wanted to put in there in the back However, it's not so clean around the corner, so I'm going to have to figure that out. And then I plan to paint it in white. Also, on the back here, I had these two um, kind of like hanging shelves with the frame that I got from Home Goods. So I hung them here, and they look so good, you guys. Like, oh my god. I cannot believe these look as good as they look and we did the same thing with these I just held them on the wall and just had my husband drive the screw through them with the level just to make sure that they're leveled I didn't measure from top to bottom to see how high how low I didn't do any of that stuff because I really don't care I just want them right here on the wall <laughs> so I ordered some towel hooks from Amazon that's supposed to come today so when those come i'm just gonna put them here i'm gonna put two on this side and then two on that side and then i'm gonna put a picture up there that says bath because this is like gonna be like the bath towel like area and then on this side i found three i actually found four um picture like bathroom picture frame thingies that i'm gonna put on this side but uh that's the next step that i'm gonna do ended up happening was my landlord agreed to buy me a new faucet and a new vanity so I did um, get those installed already I think that's probably the only thing that you guys didn't see happen in my bathroom I had and just clean it down put in all my decor and then keep it pushing okay because we need to move on to the next video so let go <laughs> Thank you. 
Okay guys, moving on to this section of the bathroom with decorating these two hanging baskets. Like I mentioned earlier in the video, I got these from Home Goods. I don't quite remember how much they were, but I think they were around $16.99 or $15.99 maybe. So I just picked stuff that I have around the house because I had spent so much money already. I didn't want to spend any more <laughs> in the bathroom. So a um, couple of things that I bought were those two little clear bottles from Dollar Tree. These tulips, I actually found these on Amazon. I don't think I paid more than $10 for the whole set. The vase that I put it in, I had in my house for a really, really long time now. This washcloth set, you can get these from TJ Maxx, Home Goods, Burlington, Marshalls, Target. You can literally get those from anywhere. And this black bottle that I just put up is actually a Bailey's bottle that I had. That's one of my perfumes that my husband got me for Christmas. That's a shampoo bottle right there <laughs> that I just put up. This little flowers, I think I got it from Marshalls maybe. You can get those for like five, six bucks. And you know, just other things that I grabbed from around the house or from Dollar Tree or stuff like that. I really didn't spend a lot of money on this area because I just wanted to keep it minimal. And then these towels I got from Burlington. So I was thinking about using this area for our bath towels, but our bath towels are all different colors right now and I didn't want to have that in this area so I just used it for decor towels for now but eventually I think I'm going to change it over to that. For my bathroom rugs I wanted to do something different. I did not want to do black or white because white definitely would get really really dirty and then black anything shows up on black any little dot any little spot so I decided to go with gray to kind of match the chrome. So this gray set, I got it from, I believe, TJ Maxx, probably Burlington, maybe Marshalls. I think it was Marshalls. And then the cover for the toilet seat, I ordered that from Amazon because you don't get these sets with, um, with the cover. So I got uh, these three pieces. They're almost the same exact gray. You can't really tell the difference as much because the seat cover is like up off the ground. But yeah, that's where I got this gray set and I absolutely love it with the bathroom. It goes really, really well. To finish up the bathroom, I added a candle. This is a $7 candle from Burlington. The packaging is absolutely amazing. And on top of that, it smells beautiful. Um, I also went ahead and added back my toiletries to the bathroom. And then I went ahead and add some more decor to the shower doors of the bathroom. I added some gray and white towel. I saw this gray towel that says blessed and I don't have a lot of wording in the bathroom so I thought that this would add a really nice touch to it. I absolutely love how it looks and then the fact that it's gray and it's really tying in the rug with the rest of the bathroom just make it stand out even more. So. My battery actually died, so I had to use my phone to record the last bit of showing you guys how the bathroom turned out. So I'm super, super sorry for this part of the video being this cut off. But this is the finished touch of my bathroom, you guys. It came out so beautiful. I absolutely love the after, the finish part. Everything about the bathroom just looks absolutely stunning. So if you guys have any other ideas of what different I could do in the bathroom, of course I'm going to change it up. I'm going to switch it around all the time because this is a new series that I want to introduce on my channel. So I'm constantly going to be changing stuff around in my house. But yeah, that's about it for this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. And I cannot wait to show you guys the next video that I have for my home decor series. Bye guys.